Hey guys, welcome to the segment. <laughs> Not a segment, just a video on our YouTube channel. Yes. How to Neil and I met. Hey All guys. Right? This is how I met your mother. Part one. Once? <laughs> our kids are gonna watch this one day, babe. Okay, okay. If we can, that's if fine. Ask we'll show us, them our We don't have to talk video. to them, we can just show them the video. Okay, that's fine. Alright, so Tanil and I met on a Friday night at youth. Yes. At church. Yes. Hallelujah. Right Whoa, you're hot. Or is that just the Holy Spirit burning inside of you? <laughs> Alright, so that's key number one. <laughs> yeah, meet at church. <laughs> meet at church. Yeah. <laughs> if you meet outside of church, that relationship's ungodly. Yeah, wow. Okay. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. For us, it was, we met at church, and I wanted to meet my wife at church. Mm -hmm. That was my prayer to God. I said, God, I don't want to meet my wife anywhere else. See, that was my prayer to the mm -hmm. Lord. I said, I want to meet her at church. She must walk in here. Mm -hmm. That's what I wanted. And that's exactly what happened. We walked into church, and I immediately felt, this is going to be my wife. And I didn't tell her that, yeah. Weird Christian boys. You didn't, like, walk up to me and be like, the Lord told me You're my wife. wife. I saw you coming down from heaven with a wedding gown. I said, Jesus, what is this? God said unto me, that is your wife. Guys, we need a race to that. That's yeah. a big red flag if you're still saying, <laughs> you're my wife. And you're telling her about the dream you had. You can, no, you can say that like later. Yeah, if you're dating the yeah, person. that's but fun. You guys, you don't even date the person, you go up to them and you say, you're my wife. I'm gonna marry you. And I'm they're like, marry you. what? You're scaring the girl away. That could yeah. have been your wife. Yeah. And all of a sudden God says, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> okay, but I like, I probably can't say the same in the sense that I trusted God to meet my husband in church. <laughs> what do you mean? What do you mean? Why are you reacting like that? <laughs> Why are you reacting like that? It's literally like I didn't have that like um Yeah, see, so you got lucky. Yeah, I didn't have that idea. A man of God receive. prayed for you back into the church. Yeah, I mean. And you're not grateful. I today. got very lucky. You're not even not lucky place. You don't even make me uh, grateful sandwiches on Mondays. I'm not saying anything because I spend my life cooking and breakfast, lunch, and supper. So <laughs> Yo, let's just hurt. not go there. <laughs> yes, I do the cooking. Yes, I do the cleaning. <laughs> <laughs> I want grateful cheese sandwiches on a Monday. That you that you say I'm thankful to God for you praying <laughs> okay. me into the church. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I want grateful massages every night. There. <laughs> Why? Thanking Why? me for those cheese sandwiches. No, 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 no. Why? Because I prayed you into the church. <laughs> okay, okay. They're asking you would have gone to hell. They're asking our events. Okay. <laughs> <pray> for you. <laughs> okay, so. All right, and then. Friday night. You were standing outside in the. Yes. When it was still that ugly brown tile looking. Mall. Area. Yeah. And I was in, okay, you can say what I was wearing, I'll say what you were wearing, because I remember what I, you were wearing. I remember Tanil was wearing a grey dress. Skirt. Skirt. Mm. But it wasn't a short skirt. No, it was, it was long. long, like to my ankles. <laughs> I was covering the whole body. <laughs> yeah, she didn't want nobody to see. With a, a pink tank top. Yes, shirt. like you know those ones back in the day that were like luminous pink, and they were like going and you'd get them at like JJ's, which is probably closed down by now, but... <laughs> Guys, let me tell you something. Tanil did not have any fashions. <laughs> okay. Okay. I had Tommy Tacky's on with the skirt. <laughs> this guy would come to church with a freaking three quarter white pants from her auntie. Yes. I have never owned a three quarter pair of white jeans. Remember the white pants I you wore. I own white jeans long. long no, white no, no, jeans. no. Not yours. You got it from your mom or someone and you wore it. Remember, I still told you to Neil, please don't wear these things. Oh, never, never. I don't agree with you. Okay, if Denise is watching this, she will confirm. <laughs> I have never you... owned a white pair of three quarter of jeans. I'm not saying you owned it, I'm saying you oh, borrowed okay. it from someone okay. and wore it to church that night. If you say so. And, okay, but tell the people, was your fashion sense amazing? Well, back then it was, okay, because I wore Tommy Tackies, which was in fashion. I wore the luminous colors, which was in fashion. Okay. You look like a now, proper. Not so much, but. He's <laughs> random. <laughs> we have to put the pictures in. I, will I find don't it. think there's photos of us back then. Uh, we will find it. <laughs> I will go look for it. 
I'll ask Danita. Imagine we took a photo on the first day we met. That would oh, have been so cool. So Guys, cute. do that. That's your next and time. Even Take like a photo the first Tenille day we meet each other. was in the front that night for prey. Nikki would always make sure he caught me. I would always go stand behind my crush. <laughs> and I would always fall because I wanted him to catch me. Yo, that is a <laughs> No, I'm kidding. That's track. actually not the truth though. That's so young truth. people, you guys probably do that, right? <laughs> All right, but that's basically how we met, right? We met at church. I prayed yeah. for that to happen. I prayed. Mm -hmm. I said, Lord, I, I made a vow. I said, Lord, I don't want to date anyone but my wife. Yeah. And she must walk into the church and I must feel a certain way when she walks in. Mm -hmm. And all three of those things happen. Yeah. I don't know why God loves me that much. <laughs> Maybe for you, God doesn't love you that much. No, wow. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. He, came, he came and he shook my hand and he said, nice to meet you. My name is Nikki. Didn't even give and a hug. He didn't like me. He didn't come near me. Yo, guys, and even the day I, I wanted to ask you for a number, yo, I was scared for yeah. like six months. I never, I never asked for a number. It wasn't that okay, long. Yeah, not that long. Yeah, it wasn't that long. But I would like say, yo, I'm going to ask you for a number now. And then I'll ask Your me. friend Rudy asked me for my number. Yeah, Rudy is the reason <laughs> I then, am married today. And then what was the funniest is Rudy was, was like, pen. Rudy was like, hey, can we, can we, can we like, um, exchange. exchange numbers? And then Nikki pulls out his phone and gives me his phone. <laughs> I was like, mm, okay, okay, wingman. <laughs> we were wearing a mini mouse shirt that night. Rudy has to be the MC. Oh, Rudy should have been the MC of that wedding, baby. It's the reason we met. Yeah, but he was in China. He was in China, true. <laughs> Alright, so that's how we met. Yeah. Tell us in the comment section how you met or what you think the perfect way is to meet your future husband and wife. Let us know. <laughs> Thank you for watching this video. We hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, keep watching the next video and the next video and the next video. And don't forget to subscribe.